Hi everyone, because I know a lot of you are short on time, I'm going to make this tutorial quick, fast, and then I'll go on a rant afterwards. So, uh, how do you get extensions on Chrome? Well, in the description bar, there's going to be a link. Uh, click on the link, put in your address bar, press enter, and um, then you'll be directed to a page with a lot of folders, with a lot of numbers. What you're going to want to do is find uh, the highest number of the list and click on it. Uh, just so you know what you're doing, uh, the number is probably going to be higher than this number right here. So, uh, once you find the number, click on it, and then in the subfolder, there's going to be a file that ends in .zip, and click on that, and it'll download straight fast, and then click on the download, and install that on your computer. Now, once you have this, you're going to realize it's not Google Chrome. I'm sorry, it's not Google Chrome. They don't have extensions for Chrome yet. They only have extensions for Chromium, which to me is actually a better version of Chrome. Um, essentially, Chromium's a beta version of Chrome uh, with a couple bugs and whatnot in it, but I've really, I've not noticed it being that bad, actually. So, uh, it's just as good as Chrome for me. So now, once you have it, you can go onto the Google Chrome extensions gallery and you should be able to click on any of these extensions and press install and you'll remember that on the previous version of Chrome for Mac uh, the install button was blacked out and you couldn't use it but now you can and now you can do things like download adblock which is one of my favorite add-ons in the world and if you download that I would recommend this one uh, if you download it, there's going to be no ads on web pages, uh, namely YouTube. Look, there's no ads, and it's beautiful. Uh, I know it's probably taking money away from people that deserve it, but it makes it uh, very visually pleasing. So uh, that's how you do all this. If you have questions, post them below, and I'm going to get into my rant soon. All right, so... Uh, for a for a really long time, I've been using a very large list of web browsers, uh, browsers like Opera and whatnot. Uh, not even browsers that most of you know of, like Internet Explorer and Safari. I've been using browsers that I don't know only people in Mongolia and stuff would know about. And I can conclude that Google Chrome is the best browser I've ever used. Uh, I know you've probably heard that it's extremely fast, but it's it's ridiculously fast. Like, if you thought, I don't know, it's, it's just really fast. Um, anyway, aside from it being fast, it's also extremely visually pleasing. I know some of you might not like the minimalistic approach of web, web browsing that it brings in, but... It's actually, it's actually really, uh, you get used to it very quickly. And uh, even, even with the extensions and whatnot, it doesn't slow down. Like, I've been trying to make this unpleasant for me, but this is, it's amazing. Anyway, uh, a lot of you are worried about Google taking over the world, but just accept it, man. It's going to happen. Like, just... One of these days, Google will take over the world, and I'll be first in line to say, go ahead, Google, use me as your labor slave because you release amazing products. And with the Nexus One and the new version of Android, I'm just, I'm all for it. You, you go take over the world, Google. I don't, I don't care. I'm giving you permission. Anyway, uh... It's it's really a beautiful, beautiful thing. <sighs> oh, hi everybody. Uh, I got an HD camera, as you can see right now. As you can see, myself being broadcasted in high definition. Sorry, there's a lot of noise outside, you fucking cars. Anyway, um... I brought you here to the window outside of my bathroom to uh, tell you a special message, which is I am making a new channel called Up in the Stratosphere, and 
It's gonna be more vloggy type stuff. It's gonna be hilarious. You're gonna be laughing your ass off every day if I choose to post videos every day. Anyway, so if you wanna check that out, youtube.com slash up in the stratosphere. I'm still gonna be making tech videos. It's gonna be funny, but uh, yeah. One of the reasons I haven't been making tech videos for a long time is because you know, the name Pony Tutorials has been, uh, ha it's been pissed me off. It's been pissed me off a lot. Why? Well, I made the name Pony Tutorials when I was a wee little lad of 14 years old. And, um, it just, it hasn't stuck. It's not, it's not a cool name anymore. It's ridiculous. I don't even know what Pony Tutorials means. Uh, and I'm considering changing the name. And, uh, anyway, if the name's pissing you off, tell me. Because uh, that'd be cool if a lot of you didn't like the name and I could change it. But if you like the name, I'm going to stick with it. But yeah. Anyway, guys. Um. Oh, that's a big truck. Anyway. Um. I'm going to be making more videos from now on because I got a camera. I fixed my computer. Everything's working smooth. And I got more free time because I was in a play. How about that? I was in a play. And I still like women. So, <laughs> it's all good. It's all good. Anyway, uh, alright guys. Uh, I know how most people tell you to comment, rate, subscribe. I don't want you to do any of those unless you want to. I'm not going to tell you to do anything. And that's going to be my whole mindset behind the new channel. Which is, which is don't comment, rate, subscribe unless you want to. Because here, in Pony Tutorials land, it's a symbiotic relationship. I don't know if that makes sense.